What's going on, Aces? Welcome back to the channel. Shout out to Phone Calls from Prison. We have new updates from Ernest Williams, who is the husband of Shirley Strawberry. And he's talking from jail to the woman, Sonia, from Florida about Shirley's daughter, Sheridan, and trying to get his truck back from the police. Let's go ahead and take a listen. Hello? Yeah. Oh, you still in the bed? You getting that, that real? I got it. Um, go around the corner and get some um, dye because my hair is great. It's just poking out. You know what? My hair is turning gray. That's oh, pretty. That's pretty. It's pretty on you. But on YouTube? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I don't have the color for it. You got the skin for it. Okay, so it's turning kind of gray where? Um, on the side, front of my head. Okay, what's wrong with that? I don't want to be old yet. I'm not ready for that. Man, it ain't, ain't old. If you fly, if you fly, that shit match. You know what I'm saying? You got that pretty mm -hmm. hair. You should be glad you got that pretty hair to work with. That wavy hair. Yeah, but you want to be um, not gray. So, I'm going to dye it. And yeah. stick it up. What? I'm gonna stick it up. I had it up this week. I'm gonna get it. Because I mean, I'm drawn out. Struggles of it. Oh, God. How was your night? Struggle. Man, this was some struggle last night. Was it? Was it because it was loud? Because it was what? Was it loud? No, just, I, you know, my sleep, and then we'd be locked down for 12 hours at night from, uh, 11 o'clock all the way down to 8 o'clock in the morning. Because I don't use the mm -hmm. cell. I was saying I could at least walk out the door. Go right. outside now, but I can walk out the cell and walk like a corner to a corner. And then uh -huh. I get on that kiosk and struggle to read it. But, uh, right. yeah, so here it ain't like that. It's like you're claustrophobic? Huh? Are you claustrophobic? No, it ain't that part. I just, you know, my mind just, uh, gets be racing, you know what I'm saying? You, know, you can't let them too much start getting depressed and shit. Right, because you're not busy until you think about shit. Yeah, and I don't want to think about shit. So, mm -hmm. that's all. Then, then if you think about shit, you're trying, to, you're trying to get answers for the shit you're thinking about, and then, yeah, you know, the, yeah that depression shit. I ain't really mm -hmm. got nothing to be depressed about, but, because I ain't in here for no, no, uh, seven days to sin, but my thing is, you know, sometimes you think about your age and think about what you're doing, and think about the people you're going to work with and help. Yeah, shit like that. That's all. Right. Yeah, you be questioning. You can't question God. You can't do that. You be questioning yourself. You can't question him. You know. Then you be uh, going in and out if life works, even dealing with it. You might be going to play them places. Uh -huh. You might go to places too. When I was sick, I mean. But I'm, I'm kind of busy right now with all, you know, <laughs> so even though I don't do anything, because I'm not thinking like, she's like, what you got to do? Go home, go in your room. I'm like, shut up. Because that's all I do. I go to work when I come home and I go straight to my room. And I'm like, I do just spend all my time in my room. If I'm not at work, I'm in my room. But that was because I just be working all the time and so. I just be resting so that I can get up and go to work, right? But I said this, this weekend I was going to do something because I do just sit in my yeah. room. But you got, a you, lot, know? you got a lot around you to entertain yourself. You got that YouTube. I mean, you got, you got. Well, yeah, I mean, I made my room comfortable. So, I mean, yeah. I don't mind it because it's nice, you know? Yeah. So, I got the patio, the skylight. You've never been over here yet. But, um, and I got really nice furniture and the nice, so it's, it's nice, I don't, you know, but I do need to do stuff, so I don't know. Yeah, I don't do anything. Yeah, I don't do anything. I just sit alone. I'm going to my son's house today, and I'm going to cook for him, and then I said I was going to go to the beach later when it gets cooler outside and just probably roller skate, exercise. Is it raining now? Um, no, it's done. It stopped raining Thursday once the hurricane passed. 
Yeah. It's talking about it's going to hurricane here. I ain't seen not one drop of rain. No, it's, it's not going to hit y'all. It, it, it hit the Carolinas real bad. That's what it did. So South Carolina, Charleston is fucked up. Really bad. Um, and, it, and it's supposed to hit Charlotte, but it's not going to hit Georgia. At first oh. it was. When it, before it hit Florida, it was supposed to go and hit Georgia, but it didn't. They canceled um, homecoming today because of that, but it's not going to go through Georgia anymore. Okay. Okay. Y'all not going to do I definitely know that it's going to be so it's, it's boring, y'all. Two days will be fucking super boring, I see that. So I definitely. Were you, you able to take your mail with you? From the, um, oh, no, they ain't sending me shit. They, they just, no, no, no. The mail that you had before you, you know, the first piece of mail you got. You talking about the, um, the email? No, the first letter you got from me. I got that, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I got that. Yeah, I got I got that. Yeah, oh. hopefully they'll, um, they'll send that other thing to you. Let's see how I get last night. Like, they should be able to forward it to you. I'm going to check my mail. I don't, it didn't come back to me yet. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, cause it was, yeah, well, yeah, I got that. I got that. Yeah, I can get that. They don't, they don't have the, um, the kiosk there. They just have the iPad. Is that how you look at your mail? Yeah, but see, they, in this phone right here, they don't, what they have here, I'm in the light to begin to say, so they got iPad, but they don't have emails. So they got telephone on, but you can't hardly hear the shit, but they got games on, so it ain't there to say so I'm mm -hmm. going to get set up honor dorms, and that way I can be around some real grown folks, and it's like more advanced there. So I can get the pictures through the kiosk. I mean, not the kiosk, but the iPad. But see, you could be keeping so much in their room, they don't, they don't share their kids and just. Right. Yeah, so I have to remind myself of that. Uh-huh. Yeah, I have to remind myself of that. But anyway, so I tried to get my truck from the guy down. The police kept calling, uh... Uh, sir, they got my truck. Trying yeah. to go down there. She said she ain't going down there. Come on, oh, it's on repo list. No, they do because she just paid shit. So my son was going to pick it up. And they're talking about, oh, they're not going to release it to him and all that. But if you get a power turn, that should be released to anybody, correct? Correct. Okay. That's all you need, the power of attorney. Yeah, that's it. So Whose name is it in? Hers? Yes, yeah, in hers. She can, yeah, she can get it to release, you know. Yeah, she can sign a power of attorney and get it released. Yeah, I know she can. So she's on hold. Mm -hmm. oh, no, we ain't releasing it to you. Yes, she can. Yes, yes she can. Sign it, get some more shit going on. Ain't shit going on. Well, why don't she want to go and get it? First of all, they're trying to uh, question her about what I got going on. She don't know what I got going on. Okay. So while that ad plays, I um I want to thank you guys for being here. Please go ahead and like the video if you haven't done so already and subscribe to the channel. Let's go ahead and take a listen. Yeah. She don't have to legally say anything. So Yeah. So she's married to you. So she doesn't legally have right. to say anything. Yeah. So but that's what that is. That's all. So she said she ain't gonna go forward with that because she don't trust none of the motherfuckers because she, her stupid ass daughter went down there. Uh, they tricked her ass down there. Just down there, just talking, talking about shit. She don't even know the fuck she talking about. Because she, that bitch, hate my guts. Yeah. Yeah. So she hate me because I don't, I don't go with that old, uh, mommy, mommy, that old shit. That ain't with that. If I'm hard on my own kids and keep them straight, I'm gonna be hard on your ass too. Cause you can't, mm -hmm. can't go in life out there and everybody paying your bills till you're fucking 40. I've seen that shit, how that shit works. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. So. It doesn't help her, it hurts her. It hurt like a motherfucker. And she don't see that. I'm like, mm -hmm. you know what's gonna happen to you? God damn, you're the shit. She gonna be lost. Hell yeah. You'll be on the fucking streets. Yeah, she gonna be lost because she don't know how to be grown. No. She don't want to know. She just think, thank you, but that's fine. She can be asked out again. She just mad at me because I told her, God damn, I don't fuck with her. I don't trust her. I don't. Yeah. No, I don't. I don't. She ain't. You know how that shit go. 
Okay, so again, his estimation of himself, like a lot, like a lot, a no, I'm sorry, like a lot of narcissists do, he has these delusions of grandeur. But anyway, that's where I'm going to um, leave it. I'll upload part 18 where this, you know, leaves off. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to the channel, and I will talk with you later. Take care, aces. Bye.